some textual evidences that support this idea in Islam that we don't have anything that, that Islam does not entertain innovations. First, you heard the introduction of the lecture. This was the way the Prophet ﷺ would introduce his Friday sermons and other occasions and khutbat uh, al-haja, even in marriage, uh, you know, marriage and, and, and you know engagements and whatever, you know, engagements and whatever. He would say this introduction, which I said part of it, but the last part of it is, wa wa al-umur. Woe to you from introducing anything into Islam because every newly introduced matter is an innovation. Every innovation will lead astray and whatever is astray is going to the fire. Now how often did the Prophet ﷺ say that? Very often. And he would be saying in that, Kullu bid'atin dalala. Every and kull linguistically huwa lafd umum wa shumul. One of the strongest uh, you know, words in indicating encompassment in the Arabic language is the kul, every. Kullu man alayha fan. Kullu nafsin da'iqatul maut. Everyone upon earth shall perish. Every soul shall taste death. Kul means every. And the Prophet Sallallahu said, every innovation will lead astray. Then we have some people come afterwards and say otherwise, but that will be coming later on. Hadith of Arbad ibn 